Gold Star families have already lost so much. All they want now is for their loved ones to be remembered. And that is the point of a new memorial that opened today at the Pentagon. Mike Gooding reports the nation's top military officer put it best when he said, let us never forget. Our strength, Gold Star family sacrifice and their spirit inspires the nation and the men and women who continue to serve in the military today. Through 13 major wars dating back to the Revolutionary War and including the Iraq and Afghanistan wars of today, more than 1.3 million U.S. service members have died in service to this country. Each of the fallen troops' families has borne that burden, as we here in Hampton Roads remembered earlier this month with the 20th anniversary of the attack against the USS Cole. And so the ribbon was cut Thursday at the Pentagon for the new Gold Star Memorial, located within the Pentagon in the Hall of Heroes. They were children, fathers, mothers, they were brothers and sisters, and they were friends and coaches and mentors and so much more. But most of all, they're American heroes, and we must remember them. Remember their service, their sacrifice, and their story. Spearheading the effort to create the new memorial was Gold Star wife Jane Horton. Her husband, Army Specialist Christopher Horton, was killed in Afghanistan in 2011. He was just 26. When I wear this pin, I wear it to represent Specialist Christopher Horton, because if I don't tell the world that he existed and tell their stories, who will know? Mike Gooding, 13 News Now.